Yeah, it's definitely um, all you can dream of, um, probably and more. So, you know, trying to soak it all in, but, you know, at the end of the day, um, you know, baseball's number one priority, so just continue to just focus up on the field. Your dad said if you were to share one message with you, considering his history here, it would be soak it in. Are you taking baseball? Think you've done your best so far at, at making that happen? Yeah, I think so. Um, got that advice a lot. Um, and you know it's real. So just really trying to just keep doing that while we're here. Fans, how happy are you for Vanderbreak in a moment like that? I mean, winning any game out here obviously is huge, but I mean, just for him personally, you know, with what he's gone through. I mean, just your thoughts on that? Yeah, uh, extremely happy for him. Um, just, just what a kid. Um, doing the interviews over there. Look that, at that. That can't be easy. Um, what he's doing, but you know, he's a captain for a reason. He's been even kill all year. He's been pulling for us all year. So you know, just whenever he stepped in that box, everyone had just the utmost confidence in him. You said in the past that y'all were 100% the best outfield in the country. Do you think you guys proved that tonight? I think so. Um, you know, we didn't get tested too hard, uh, but we got lucky with the wind a little bit. Um, you know, UVA scored some balls, so just uh, just keep playing, keep playing good ball, and we'll see what happens. What's special about the ground between the three of you? <sighs> I think you know we're very close. Um, first off. You know, we know each other really well. Uh, we spend a lot of time together. Um, so just, I think those two things, um, and you know, like I said, we spend a lot of time together, so we know each other, and you know, everyone has super, just high levels of confidence in the other one. What does that look like when you guys spend time together off the field? <laughs> it can be anything. Uh, we've done it all. You can name it, we've done it. How would you, des how would you describe this team's repeated ability to get into a crunch time type moment, a ninth inning, a tenth inning, whatever, and succeed. Like, what what is that ability that you think you guys have? Um, you know, Coach Forbes preaches stay with the process, um, focus on the process, don't worry about you know outcomes. And I think you know everyone's just really bought into that. Um, you know. We were, I, I think, all year that we've just really said, you know what, it doesn't really matter about the situation of the game. Just continue to just bear down and just be on the hunt. And what? And what? Let's just take us, if you don't mind, uh, just like what is your thought process as you're going up there, you know, in the in the ninth, with, you know, with the Vandy on third and, and you know, hit wins it. Like, just what is that? What does that look like in your mind as you're, you, you know, you you're up there at the plate? Yeah, just really slow it down. Um, Coach Rears does an incredible job with us about approach. So, you know, not, I mean, just not trying to do too much. Um, just slow the game down, control your breathing, and just stay up the process. And they chased you into the outfield. They did. Yeah, that was fun. Yeah.